Hello there, I am Giant Quote from Pokemon Crystal. In the last part, we took on Elite Four Champion Lance, we beat him, and we became the champion of the Johto League, and now we're gonna head off to Kanto now. So I'm here in Olivine City. As I said in the last part, I did train all my Pokemon up to level 60, so that's pretty cool. Um, as far as moves, I don't think anyone learned anything new, but it's been a while since I actually recorded, probably like two or three months, honestly. <laughs> Jeez. But yeah. Um, I got the M, okay, Confusion, take down, up. Nope, I don't think it is, uh, no, Noctar didn't learn anything new, Oliver didn't learn anything new. Um, I think, um, Mystic learned Morning Sun off screen, I could be wrong about that. Um, Megan, uh, I don't think she learned anything new. Um, Blaze, uh, nope, nothing new really. Sanders, uh, nope. Bro, slow. He may have been psychic off screen, I can't remember. Yeah, and that's it really. Nice. Okay. So let's head off to the SS Aqua now, now that we have a ticket. Yeah, let's just do that. Can we hot ride a bike on here? Nope, we can't. Okay, hit. <laughs> Alright, welcome to the fast ship SS Aqua. Will you be boarding today? Yes. May I see your tickets? Uh, yeah, flash the SS ticket. That's it. Thank you. And we get to go on the boat. Yay. We'll be departing soon. Please get on board. Okay. So now we can't leave for a while. So that kind of stinks. We're moving now. That's awesome. Oh, wait. Whoa, excuse me. I'm in a hurry. My granddaughter is missing. She's just a wee girl. If you see her, please let me know. Okay. I think this is the first room is where you can heal up at the bed. I guess you can actually, never mind. That's cool. That you could. Okay. Here's um person, I guess. Are you alone? No, it's battle. I'll probably skip to the end. I'll, I'll show this first battle, and then for the remainder of the battles, I'll probably just skip over to the end, actually, because there's a lot of battles on this SS Aqua. I figured I have up front, though. I honestly forget. <laughs> right. I think I have, uh, I forget, honestly. All of, okay, I, I just forgot for some reason. Let's go for the swift attack, I guess. This sand slash is level 31 in male. So that's pretty cool. So it almost takes it out. It's gonna use poison sting on Oliver. There we go. Let's use another swift attack then. Nice. I like it. I can know it's about to use a golem. We'll switch to uh, um, Megan, I guess. Megan. <laughs> this golem is level 33 in male. Nice. One way we should put this thing to. We should get rid of the sail. I mean, like, faint it, obviously. Let's go for the razor leaf. Like the music. Do, 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 It's good catchy music for the battle music. It's really good. Okay, I just had to check if my microphone's gain was up all the way, because I was worried about that. I wanted to check it. Yeah, thanks for the 2,112 pocket dollars. Sorry for skipping your dialogue, though. Let's see, there's nothing in here. There's nothing in here. Haha. <laughs> okay. Let's go to the next room then. Oh, by the way, I'm using a Switch Pro Controller. Nintendo Switch Pro Controller. Um, because I actually forgot to bring my, um, May Flash GameCube adapter to my dad's. And so I have two GameCube controllers with me, but, uh, I don't have the GameCube adapter. So I was like, hey, well, doesn't the Pro Controller work on Windows 10 for, like, emulators and stuff? And it does. I'm using the Visual Boy Advance right now as my emulator, and it's the the um, Nintendo Switch Pro Controller actually connects to uh, Bluetooth, which is awesome. So I'm able to use, which might be my go-to um, controller now because it's a nice feeling, and uh, it's just that um, every time it every time we don't have the GameCube adapter or the GameCube controller both plugged in the USB port before I launch uh, Visual Boy Advance, it, it uh, automatically makes me have to like calibrate my controller again. So that kind of stinks, but with the Pro Controller, we don't have to usually do that. So that's awesome. Even if we unplug it like that, I'm, I keep it, I've plugged it in my USB port because for some reason, my uh, controller can't hold the charge anymore for some reason, so I must be plugged in, which kind of stinks. As far as I know, at least, but that's okay. 
Here's the PC. I guess we could do the PC trick where we put in everyone but one Pokemon in the PC and then switch it out with the Pokemon we didn't put in the PC to by Pokemon. So, but we don't really need to do that right now, so that's good. Oh, here's a bed. Oh, look at all. We could just tail up here. How nice. Awesome. Okay. This is a big place. I'll tell you that. Okay, I'm going to Kanto to put my fire breathing sh put, put on the fire breathing shows. I'll see you guys in the next battle. Okay, so fire breathing Lyle had two coughings and a Flareon. So that was pretty easy because all of had confusion. And uh, we also just swift on the flare on one swift that was able to take it down, I guess. Fizzle, the flame's tiny. Sorry, man, thanks for the 680 Pokedex Arsons. The present mine is double because I'm using all of it. I almost forgot because it's the ammo coin. Awesome. So there's that battle. This is just an empty room, I guess. Okay. I'm not going to talk to the sailor guy, but that's okay. I think this is a hiker right here. Hey kid, want to battle with me? Sure, why not? Okay, so that poker fan Colin had a uh, one deli bird. Which is easy because we just used one swift to defeat it. Awesome. Thanks for 5,120 poker dollars. Here's some twins next. Awesome. You think I'm a baby? That's not fair. I'm sorry. I didn't say that. So twins Meg and Peg were defeated. They had a Teddy Ursa and a fa and a Vampy. That's pretty cool. Oh, we lost. I'm sorry. Thanks for 1,240 poker dollars. Yeah, okay, um, is there anything else in this room? I don't think there is. Nope, okay. Cool, just checking. On to the next room, then. Oh, hello. I'm stuck in front of my granddaughter. If she's on the ship, that's okay. She's an, uh, she's an energetic child, but she may, she may be bugging someone. I'm worried. Well, I'll help you find her. Actually, you have to help her find. You have to help find her anyway to progress in the story, basically. So we'll do that just soon enough. Now, did I get all? I'm just checking if I got all the rooms up here. I think I did, but I could have missed like a staircase or something. Nope. Okay. Okay. Well, we're good. Oh, actually, I want to heal up at this bed real quick. Just real quick. Comfy bed. Time to sleep. Okay. I like the Pokemon Center chime. Nice. Now we can go down a floor, I believe. To the lower level of the ship. And there we go, nice. Okay, so. Wait, hold on, this guy box. Okay, what is it? Hey kid, can I get you to look for my buddy? He's creeping off somewhere, that lazy bum. I want you to go find him, but I'm on duty right now. Okay, so we okay, I think we have to talk to one of those sailors, actually. Is it this guy right here? The passengers are all trainers. They're still itching to battle in their cabins. Uh, did I not talk to- uh, Okay, apparently I want to talk to everyone, apparently, just in case. I think this is just that one guy's room, and then the thing also, okay. So I have to actually find him now. Oh, uh, man. I think he's on- I think he's on the cabins uh, the, where the beds are, that line of cabins up there, but I, I'm gonna check these cabins just to be sure. Because I honestly forget where he is, I just have to look for him, honestly. No one else in this room? Okay, cool. Or in this cabin, I should say. What about in this cabin? Oh yeah, this is the grandpa. Okay, my bad, sorry. I'll find your daughter, I promise. I promise, I promise. You can count on it. Okay. So he's gotta be in one of these cabins right here. Cause I don't think it's this guy, cause if you talk to him, I'll just say, Fashionbach was en route to Roman City. We will be making an announcement when we arrive. Okay. So I think it's in one of these cabins that's press of elimination service me right here. I'm hoping it does. Yeah. Ready about you, okay. Oh dang, I didn't mean to do that. Shoot. Epic fail. <laughs> yeah, I'm all... Okay, yeah, okay, wait, okay, we battle him apparently. I think this is the guy though. I wasn't goofing off. This cabin was, uh, vacant, so I just took a quiet nap. Ah, oh, forget it. Let's battle. Okay, let's battle. Okay, Sailor Stanley was defeated. Awesome. Sorry, uh, that's all my fault. I'm so don't worry, don't worry, man. No sweat, no sweat. It's okay. Thanks for the 2080 poker dollars. Yeah, being a sailor, I have to do physical labor. It's exhausting. So he goes off. And that ends that, I guess. Again, uh, we could heal up, but I'm gonna just skip out on it, because it's only really all I've always been used. 
so far for Pokemon Battles. <laughs> He's almost level 61 though, so when he reaches level 61, I'll switch off. Let's talk to him again. Thanks, kid. I chewed him out f going good, so he'll quit slacking off. Hey, little girl? I may have seen her go by here. Interesting, okay. I think one of these trainers is an APOM, which is pretty cool. Or if I'm seasick. Okay, you're seasick, man. I'm sorry. Okay, all for good level 61. Awesome, yay. And that is the end of that battle. Juggler Fritz was defeated. Awesome. I can't move anymore. I'm sorry, man. Thanks for the 2320 Poké Dollars. Is there anything in that trash can, by the way? No, nothing in here. Dang it. Okay. That's cool. Does anyone else appear besides a bed? Yeah, there's just a bunch of beds in one trade. Okay. Let's actually switch Pokemon. So, let's see here. Um, let's put over to the very bottom, I guess. Yeah, let's put Bros up front. Cool. I like it. He's in the sailor dude. Let's take him on. Of course, I'm going to skip through his battle, though. Not beat. Not. Nothing beats a battle uh, when I'm on my break. Interesting. Cool. Okay, so Sarah Jeff was defeated. Awesome. Yeah, when I lose, my break's over. Thanks for 1,280 Poké Dollars, man. Really appreciate it. That guy had two eradicates. So that's pretty cool. What do you have to say? Oh, you have a train. Okay. I'm so bored. Want to battle? Sure, let's battle, man. Let's battle, little young lady, I guess. So Picnic or Deborah had one Pokemon I was like, seeking. How awesome. You, you're too strong. I'm sorry. Thanks for the 660 Poké Dollars. To be fair, I am the Pokemon League champion now. So, uh, yeah. I wanted to make sure I wasn't missing out. I am there past the stairs. So now we go up a level, I think. And here we are in the cabin's room right here. So let's talk to this little girl. We found the little girl, I bet. Okay, Captain, please play with me, please. I'm bored. I want to play more. Hmm, will you play with me? Oh, Grandpa's worried about me? I have to go. I have to go find Grandpa. He's all shocked. Uh, Grandpa, here I am. I was playing with the captain and this guy. Stephen, was it? I heard you entering, entertained my granddaughter. Um, I want to thank you for that. I know, I'd like you to have this. We get the metal coat, which if you give it to a Caesar or a, um, if you give it to a Scyther or an Onyx and trade it with it held, holding the item, then Onyx will evolve into Steelix and then Scyther will evolve into Caesar. So that's awesome. I, I didn't mean to speed up there for a second, my bad. Okay, yeah. Steven put the metal code in the metal, in the item's pocket. Cool. Oh, we got a little announcement. Fast ship SSL has arrived in Vermilion City. Okay. I want to go back to where that cabin, the captain was, though, because he might give us an item. I just want to make sure, though. Just to make sure. Yay. Wait, good. <laughs> Hooray for backtracking him, alright? <laughs> Is there anything else in this hallway? Nope, just the captain's quarters, I guess you could say. Let's talk to him real quick. Um, phew, thanks for coming along. Keeping up, keeping that little girl amused was exhausting. Is that all you say? Okay. I thought you could give me, like, an item or something, but that's okay. I can't, I can't check your trash can because you're blocking it. Oh, whatever, but whatever. <laughs> yeah, nice. Okay, I'll meet you guys back where, um, we're in front of that bed, so I'm gonna heal real quick. Okay, let's take a little nap. It's a comfy bed. Time to sleep. Okay. Just to heal by Pokemon for free. Hey, nice. Okay. So after that, we can actually go back to the entrance of the boat where we came in. And talk to this young guy. This sailor. Fast ship SS Elkwood has arrived in Vermillion City. He lets us through. Nice. Nice. Okay. And we're magically almost in Vermillion City. Oh my gosh, this mix, the music is so awesome here. A remix of the original Vermillion City music, awesome. There's no time, there's no little tag at the bottom saying we move, we're in Vermillion City, dang it. Okay, let's talk to you. Skill trainers gather in Kanto. Gym leaders are especially strong. They won't be easy to defeat. Interesting. We'll see about that. Here's a giant Snorlax. Snorlax is snoring peacefully. We'll get to that later. Okay, so is there anything I want to sell to the Mart real quick? I don't know. I forget. Um, Let's see here. Metal Co. I'm going to put that in the PC, actually. But other than that, I should be good. 
Um, let's buy. I have to check how much Ultra Balls I have and stuff. Okay, I'm gonna buy three more Ultra Balls. Um, yeah, we should be good, really, other than that. Maybe buy a couple more Hyper Potions. So, three more Ultra Balls. Just for the heck of it, let's buy five more Super Potions. Let's buy three more Hyper Potions. Let's buy two more Revives. Just they're just random numbers, I think we're gonna lead, actually. Um, for us, heals, awakenings, yeah, okay. We know we don't need anything else, okay, cool. Nice. And, uh, here's where we get the bike voucher in the original games. I don't think we have to do that because we already have a bicycle, obviously, but yeah. Ah, oh, man, okay, so here's, I'm gonna heal up at the Pokemon Center, even though, just to make sure I, I can come back here with Fly. I wanna see up here back. Okay. So, I'm at. I'm at 18 minutes, um, I guess I can go quickly battle the trainers, although I'm going to skip through their battles here, um, before I take on the gym. I'm not going to do the gyms in the original Kanto order, like Chug Count we did, so, like, the first gym in Kanto I'm going to face is obviously the Roman City gym, because it's the closest. I can just surf around instead of using Cut on where that tree is, for the gym, near the gym, or in front of the gym, I guess should say, no, more near the gym, because it's not in front of the gym, honestly, it's like, it's like the side of it. But, um, I still have Bros up front, right? Okay, yeah. So I'm gonna just skip through all these Pokemon battles, uh, skip to the end of them, I guess. My fan fear is the cutest in the world. Interesting. Nice. Oh, I, I might as well show this- I might show- I might as well show this first battle because the new Kanto trainer battle music is pretty awesome. Pokefan Rex is about to send out Fampy. Okay, I kinda guessed because you said in your dialogue that you had a Fampy that was really cute. So this Fampy is level 35 in male. Let's go for the Surf Attack then. Same type of attack bonus. So, Bro Slow is 26 levels higher than this thing. Wait, so, wait, no, um, maybe 25. Yeah, 25 levels higher than it, yeah, because 35 plus 25 is 60, yeah, okay. So, 25 levels higher than this. Nice. And that's all she wrote, but the train of battle music for Kanto is really nice. Pokefan Rex was defeated awesome. My fan for you, sorry man. Thanks for the two twenty eight hundred Poke dollars. And then let's talk to you. Uh, my Teddy Ars is the cutest thing. Oh, you said the same thing about Teddy Ars. <laughs> Jeez, well, that's cute though. Okay, so Pokefan Alan was defeated at a Teddy Ars, if you didn't already guess. My Teddy Ars, uh, thanks for yeah, giving the same amount of Poke dollars. Awesome, thank you. I think there's only three more trainers left on this route. I could be wrong. Oh, is that it, really? Because Kanto has a little bit less trainers, I guess, on these routes than the original games. And Fi Pokemon Fire Red, and Leaf Green for that matter, but still. Is there an item here? I think there is. You'd think that there'd be a hidden item here, but I can't. apparently there's not. Oh, that's a bummer. What about right here? I'm just checking. Ah, oh, jeez, I'm looking so hard for a hidden item or something. I'm like so desperate right now. I guess not. Okay. What do you have to say? The road is closed until the problem. Uh, as the PowerPoint is solved. Wait, well, I misread that. Sorry. The road is closed until we, the problem at the PowerPoint is solved. This is the underground path or one of them, I guess. Yeah, underground path. Uh, so it goes from, uh... Roman City all the way to Ruin City, which is nice. Even though they're really close together on the map. In fact, I might as well show the map. Um, so we're on Route 6 right here, so it's just it's just north of Roman City. And Ruin City is right here. So we can take another good path to get to Ruin City easily, but uh, the problem at the PowerPoint has to be solved or something. Let's see if on this water. I think there might be an item here. I could be wrong. I'm just gonna check. I don't have a repel on. Dang it, okay. Yeah. Also, I'm gonna show this the um I'm gonna actually show wild Pokemon battle here, because Kanto has really good wild Pokemon battle music too. Listen to it. I really like the battle music in Kanto, it's awesome. The remix of it for Gen 2. I think it's, it's nice for this, look, this Eradicator is level 15 in male. So the Pokemon Pokemon walk should be the, um, around the same level as the original games. Even though your Pokemon are probably level 50s or 60s like mine. Well, I, over, I trained, overtrained a lot. 
or grind it all, I guess you could say, but like, your Pokemon should be around level 45 or 50 by this point. Maybe a little less than that, actually, if you just didn't train for the Pokemon League, either times. Like, I trained twice, once after, once before the Pokemon League, and then once after. So that's why. I'm level 60, I'm kinda overleveled, but I kinda wanna just breeze through Kanto, even though it's not much of a challenge still. You know. Okay. But yeah, that, the, you know, the, the um, battle music for Kanto, the remix for Gen 2, is really nice. I like the sound of it, really. So here is the Vermilion City Pokemon Gym. Yeah. Let's step around the street because we don't have cut. Is there an item here? There is. Awesome. We got Fuhi. Awesome. Get the Guardi check there. Nice. Okay. So here is um, Vermilion City Pokemon Gym Leader, Lieutenant Surge. Lightning American. Okay. So they use um, electric type Pokemon just like in the original games and in Gen 3 for Fire and Leaf Green. If you didn't already know, but everyone and their mom probably knows that. <laughs> Let's go switch to Sanders and because it's a pure ground type or just any electric type attack, which is awesome. So yeah, in the next part we'll take on the Vermilion City Pokemon Gym and hopefully make our way to the Power Plant eventually because that's where we have to go next. So yeah, so this has been Jonko again. I would like to thank you goodbye and hope to see you guys next time my Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough Guide.